What's going on guys? We are back here at Calgary Barbell. Recently had the pleasure of having a gentleman named Adam Ramsey in from BC lifting at Calgary Barbell here. Uh, we got to do some equipped squat and bench with him and we had him do a really, really great tutorial on how he wraps his knees. Uh, definitely listen to this guy because he's a fantastic lifter. He's Wilkes over 600 in equipment uh, and is hopefully soon on his way to the World Games, which is an incredible feat in powerlifting. Uh, so check the video out. Uh, my name is Adam Ramsey. I'm an equipped powerlifter in the Canadian Powerlifting Union in IPF and I'm gonna show you a little bit about how I wrap my knees. Um, I've always trained alone, so I always wrap my knees by myself. And associated with that uh, limitation, I wrap them loose. So you'll often see people stretching knee wraps and rolling them up like this, with the idea being that they're stretched before you start putting them on your knees, so you only have to stretch them less to get them on your knees. But uh, when I wrap them myself, and particularly when you use a, a stiff wrap, like the Titan Signature Gold, there's only so much stretch in them, so I find it um, easier to do so to wrap right on the knees. So when you wrap your knees, the thing to remember is that we're trying to get support to extend the knee stronger. So ultimately, you are looking at the compression of the wrap on the back of the knee and the stretching of the wrap on the front of the knee. So with that in mind, you see some people start their wrap here, but that's obviously pointless. There's neither stretching nor uh, compressing on the back, so that's pointless. So when you start wrapping your knee, the way I think about it is if you find the big bony protrusion, the tibial tuberosity on the front here. Um, for most people, obviously everyone's a little bit unique for their anatomy, but for most people, if you just cover that or just right at it on the bottom corner of your wrap, that's a suitable place to start. Because then the first wrap, the very bottom of it is not quite stretching, um, but when it's tight, most of the wrap will stretch. So I think that's a suitable place to start. And when you wrap, you want to have it always stretched. You don't want to like do one wrap and then stretch it and then do a wrap and then stretch it. You want to stretch it every time you pull it. So we start with it here, you stretch it around and then you tack it down and then we stretch it here, stretch it back, reach around. You can use some leverage off your leg to stretch it around here and then over top. Um, and when you're doing this, it's a lot more work if I was holding the knee wrap out here because then I'd have to stretch a foot of wrap. But if I hold it close, I only have to stretch the relevant inch of wrap. So when you wrap as well, you wanna make sure that your leg is small at the time. So the way you do this by having your leg straight and you extend your toes, your calf gets out of the way, and then you flex your quad so your vastus lateralis gets out of the way a little bit. So as we continue stretching, always stretching every point, stretch, back, reach around, stretch, around. The way I wrap my knees is I do four wraps up. And the reason I do that is because I want my top wrap to be about half over my vastus lateralis. For most people, that's a suitable point where we're at the end of where the knee wrap would stretch any higher and it's just gonna be around my quad and just hurt like hell. So once we get around four times, I find that if then we do an X, where we go down and then back up, this seems to lock the wrap in place. So it's a lot stiffer and then we go around and then the way I tie my wrap, it's kind of unique. I put my hand in like this, and then I reach around and tuck the wrap just behind my knuckles. And if the wrap is tucked in like this, where you just see the very corner, Adam Ramsey will guarantee that'll never fall out, and that's gonna be a nice stiff wrap. I, I can't bend my knee at all, no matter how hard I try. Yeah. So that's how I wrap my knees. Uh, for the sake of reducing my suffering, I won't wrap the other one now, if that's okay with Bryce. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. Well, it's nice and easy to undo.